apparently the apartment building I live in is now being sold. So I might not even have an apartment in three months. Like which one do I, I freaking keep? I don't know. <laughs> I'm not an English major. No, I don't need this. Damn. It's like, I don't want to get rid of my mugs, but there's so many. Mom, I can get this for you. If you don't get out of that dumbass thing. <laughs> like, it's much better than it was, but it's still shit. <laughs> Sorry, girl. Look at that! I know, baby, don't look at it. Girl. I mean, it's, it's a seamless look. Who gives a fuck? <laughs> Hey y'all, it's Bria and welcome back to another vlog. So if you've seen any of my other recent vlogs, you know that I'm currently in the process of moving back to my college apartment in Binghamton. Um, it's basically a month away now because it's, July is tomorrow and I go back in August to go to school. So I have a whole lot of stuff that I want to do to my apartment. So we're going up there today because when I go back in August, I just want to be able to move back in, you know, put all my stuff in there, relax and just get ready and just prepare myself mentally to go back to school again. Ooh, why does my upper lip look so sweaty? Anyway, sorry, I had to switch my hand because this arm is hurting. Um, but yes, yeah, so we're basically just decluttering everything. I wanna paint my kitchen wall. I have some new stuff that I wanna bring up there, like some furniture and other things. So I just want a whole new apartment. Like I want it to feel like I'm living in a whole new apartment. I want a fresh start and I just want it to look, you know, really nice. It is 9.52 right now. We we got to go because like I said, it takes two hours to get there. And uh, we were supposed to stay overnight and come back home tomorrow morning, Saturday morning. But to be honest, I do not want to stay overnight, y'all. Like there's no Wi-Fi there right now because I haven't set the Wi-Fi back up. And I just, it's hot as hell in that apartment in the summer. So I don't really know if I want to stay overnight. I might pack a bag just in case because... It could take a while to do all this stuff and I don't want to be driving back late at night. So I'll probably pack like a little overnight bag and then we'll head out. Well, first I need to pack up the car. We can't just head out. I have a bunch of stuff I need to put in the car. Some things I need my mom's help because they're heavy. Like this new mirror I got. I'm so obsessed with this mirror. I have to figure out where I'm going to put it in my apartment. So let me show you. Y'all, there's something wrong with these dogs, man. <laughs> I don't think I ever introduced you guys to my dogs, but quick introduction. This is Chico. This is Ursula. This is Millie. She's the daughter. She's the mom. He's just, he's an outcast, but he's a good boy. Oh, look at him. But yes, let me give you guys a quick little overview of some of the stuff that I got for my apartment so far. I am, y'all, I haven't seen this mirror because I don't come over here. Let me show you guys the stuff. I am... I'm so obsessed. So like I said, over here is this beautiful gold um, floor mirror. Like, look at this. It's over here right now, but it's so tall. I've been needing a body mirror for my apartment so bad. Like I don't have one. How did I live in that apartment for two years with no body mirror? I don't know. Don't ask me. Um, but anyways, here is a new rug for my living room. I wanted like a short rug. I have like a very shaggy rug. I actually just threw it out the last time we went up to my apartment to bring my new couch. I have to show you guys that as well. Anyways, um, but yes, I threw out my old rug from the living room. So I got like this nice white and gray one to match my new couch. So excited y'all. I'm so excited. I got a new whiteboard for my kitchen. I have one just like this, except it only has the calendar. It doesn't have like these extra boxes. So I got this at um, Michael's actually on clearance. It was 50% off y'all. If you're looking for nice home decor, go to Michael's. They always have stuff on clearance from like different um, collections and seasons. So in this Ikea box, if you guys saw the last vlog, we went and got that shoe cabinet for the living room. Over here, I have some doormats for in front of the door, like when you come inside, you know, and you know, you step in and you take your shoes off, you step on this before you step on the floor. Um, under here, I have this really cute box. Again, I got this from Michaels, y'all. So freaking cute. I'm gonna put this in my office. It's gonna be like my travel memory box. I put all like my old boarding passes and like pictures of my trips in here. And then I also have like these little bubble letters for my office. I'll show you guys that when we get there, but I absolutely love this little memory box. In this bag, I have this fake plant from Ikea, and then what else? I have a little pillow from Home Goods and some washcloths. 
a vase just random little stuff so i also have like a ton of other random stuff that i've collected over the past year that i've been out of school so that stuff is already up there um when we came back from was it yeah when we came back from Aruba, we actually rented a U-Haul because, like I said, I bought a new couch. I'm so excited about it. Um, we bought, um, we rented a U-Haul and brought the couch up there. And I also brought, like, my clothing rack, all my winter clothes and stuff. Like, just all the stuff that I don't need right now, I brought up there. And, like, some of the decorations that I bought for my apartment. So, yes, a lot of that stuff is already up there. But this is just some of the new stuff I've gotten since then. So I'm just honestly so excited, y'all. I'm so excited. I love decorating. I love cleaning. Like, that's just who I am. Like, I love getting my life together. Like, it's just fun to me. So I'm so excited to bring all this stuff up. Like, the vibes is giving. Like, I'm going for a neutral gold, white, gray with a little touch of pink. Not too much pink. My living room was so pink. Like, everything was pink. So I want to kind of move into the more neutrals with a little splash of pink because... Obviously, I still like pink, but I want to kind of tone things down a bit. Like, I think I'm going to get rid of some of my Squishmallows. Like, I really love them, but they're just not, they're not, you know, fulfilling anything in my life anymore. So I just want a whole fresh new start in this new chapter. Like, I'm about to be 21 going back to college. I just want a fresh start, y'all. That's all I want. So we're going to pack up the car and go get something to eat. So let's get this day started. Which, okay. Yeah, yeah. And then let it lay down. Is it? Yeah. Oh, child, it's already hot out here. I know, it's hot. All right, so we're stopping for gas, and then I think, I really don't want Dunkin' Donuts, but I might have to just get a little something there to eat because I am starving. Like, all we brought is like, some of this popcorn and water, and I have my, my palm tea, but that's really it. Um, so I'm definitely gonna stop for something. I don't know what, though. But we'll see. Um, but what do y'all think of my hair? Like, I kinda switched it up a little. Like, instead of, like, I usually brush it down and just, like, like, the top is usually flat and I usually have this tucked. Like, I could still tuck it, but I'm just, like, letting my hair be natural and free. Like, I didn't, you know, like, I usually put the product in and then brush it through so that the curls are more, like, defined and then I separate them later. But I just separated everything. I scrunched it. Like, I never do that. Like, I scrunched it and everything. So, let me know what y'all think. Um... I don't know, I think I'm just gonna try to switch it up. I really wanted to get like one of those curly cuts, but I couldn't get an appointment that for a date that worked for me. And um, the only appointment that I could take was like the curly cut in color. And I'm not paying $700 to get my hair dyed. I don't wanna dye my hair anyways, cause it has like a natural red tint. Like I don't wanna change my hair color. And I'm also not paying $700 to get my hair done, please. But yeah, let me know what y'all think. I kinda, you know, try to switch it up. But yes. Um, we just found out some very interesting news. Apparently, the apartment building I live in is now being sold. So I might not even have an apartment in three months. So that's great. Um, but you know what? Everything happens for a reason. You know, it's always God's plan over my plan. You know, he, he knows what he's doing. So, you know, because even before I was moving back to school, I was like, I want a new apartment. But it just made more sense to stay at this apartment because it's way more affordable. But um, I might end up in a new apartment, y'all. I don't know. We'll see. Um, but at this moment, I don't know. The house is being sold. It could be sold in a few months. It could be sold tomorrow. The world might never know. I'm gonna just, you know, trust God. All right, so we did end up getting food, but we just went to, what is it? Do 
Family Dollar. I can never remember which is which. Dollar General, Family Dollar. Same. They all the same to me. But I just got some cheese doodles and we're going to share these corn nuts because I just can't figure out what the heck I want to eat. So we're just going to get snacks and then we're going to get something to eat later. Two hours later. All right. So we finally made it up here to the apartment. Let me give you guys a quick little overview of what exactly we're doing. Just to give you an idea. I'm not going to show you everything, but there's a lot. So let's, let me just show y'all. So like I said, my new couch is up here and everything. This is the living room. It's very tiny in here, but it's been exactly what I needed these past few years at school. But I have like um, my shelf and all that stuff, but there's just like so much random stuff. Like as you can see, I just brought all my clothes up here. I have, this is my room. I want to get rid of some things in here. Um, I have like my giant pushing and stuff. This back room is like so freaking busted. Like, oh my god, I have so much random shit. Like, it's just too much to deal with. And then in the kitchen, I have to organize everything. I want to declutter so much stuff. I just brought this clothing rack up here. Um, and then in here is like my office where I do schoolwork. Like, things like this. I want to get rid of this picture, but I still like my lamp. And, like, I have my desk that I work out and everything. Oh, my God. I forgot about this chair, y'all. I love this computer chair. Like, I'm so obsessed with this chair. Um, but, like, that little Target thing I'm going to get rid of. The shoe rack I'm getting rid of. And then this whole area just, like, this is, like, a storage closet. But I just need to clean and declutter everything. So, we're going to bring all the new stuff in. And then we're going to put some of the furniture and stuff together. And then just literally clean up and declutter and get rid of so much stuff like there's so many things that i want to get rid of we might have a yard sale i might sell it online who knows but i'm just ready to clean this place out like like i said who knows if i'll even be here after a few months but i still want to get my stuff together regardless of if i'll be living here but we'll see y'all we will see but let's just get to work so that we can just hang out and go get lunch and stuff Brianna, it's the same. no because i literally okay, okay. so I this is my it. original <laughs> whiteboard. It has the month, the today, and the week. And I said, oh, I want to get this one because this one has the week on it and this one doesn't. But they are kind of different. This one has a bigger calendar, which I think I like. Like, you see how the calendar itself is bigger? But I kind of like the today list there where you can, like, you know. Yeah, but it doesn't, I don't know. I mean, they're very similar. I'm like, what? still has a notes box, so that's good. Like, which one I do I freaking know. keep? I don't <laughs> know. Yeah, that's, yeah, I'm kind of stupid that I didn't, a little like, bit. remember that. A little bit. All right, so first, I want to take a look in this freaking closet and see what stuff exactly left behind. So I have, like my tote bags in here, which I think I'm gonna sell. A mini lint roller, there's literally nothing in there. And then this other one, I think I'm gonna sell too because I'm not gonna use these for school. Is there anything in there? My wallet. So I'm definitely gonna sell those. I have a bunch of like bags in here from buying stuff. Yeah, I'm gonna, I don't need to keep all this. I hate the fact that I keep so much random stuff. I have like some like sweaters that I don't really wear. I'll probably like look at this robe. Like, I never wore that. Oh, damn. All right, I'm just gonna take everything out regardless so I can go through it. Down here is just like a bunch of shoe boxes that I feel like, like look, all of these are empty. Come on now. I don't think I need any of these. This box is really cute though, but I don't need it. Like there's literally no shoes in here. So I think I'm gonna get rid of most of these boxes since they're like from Target and stuff. So I'm gonna get rid of all of these. <laughs> i
comments, leave me out of nonsense, speaking out of context, people need some content, niggas trying to keep up, shit is not a contest, whipping best concept, heaven said, God said, this is what my mom says, proof is in the progress, money's not a object, busy than a motherfucker, you know how my job get, walking up the wrong tree, you know how the dogs get, haven't fallen off yet, come with a classic, they come around, you stay there and say it's a sleeper, the ears are red, the petty is real, I just my ex for a feature, deposit the money to Brenda Latina. Belinda Felicia, she gave me twice, I didn't even know for once, you know I'm a pleaser, 42 millimeter, was made in Geneva, yeah, I probably should go to Yeshiva, we went to Ibiza, yeah, I probably should go live with Yeezy, I need me some Jesus, as soon as I started confessing my sins, he wouldn't believe us, sins, I got sins on my mind, and some L's, got a lot of L's on my mind, and my friends, yeah, I keep my friends on my mind, I'm in love, I'm in love with two girls and one to them and they tens. That's why I got ten on my mind. I got M's. Got a lot of M's on my mind. And my friends. Yeah, I keep my friends on my mind. She repent. I need me some Jesus in my life. I ain't from the fool, but I love your bitch. The only thing that she might be secret. Trying to dish me, blow up my people. I can't respond with this, but what you pick with? I got some rats on the bed. You can keep it. This shit getting deeper and deeper. I dig in my shit. I'm on bed. I was going to have to fix it. A shark in the water. You're strong with it. Look at this big ass book. I wonder if somebody will buy this. Oh my god! <laughs> what class was that? That class I dropped. Wow. <laughs> what does it say? The Norton Shakespeare. Everything. And it's they wanted us to read this. Yes, they wanted yeah, us to no, read this. Yeah, for me immediately. One semester, this whole book? Nah, I'm not doing it. Yeah, that's why I dropped that out. I'm not going to be able to do it. Drop that thing. I'm not an English major. No, I don't need this. I, I don't know. Bring out the test tubes. <laughs> I don't need the books. Bring me to the lab. Yeah, for real, that's ridiculous. Bring me to the lab, and I'll show you what I can really do. But this is a no for me. All right, so we've been cleaning for a few hours now. I'm honestly so tired. We still haven't eaten a real meal. But we have reservations to go to the Lost Dog at 5 o'clock, so... Around like 4.30, we're going to go pick my grandpa up. We're going to go out to dinner. But for now, we're still just trying to declutter. So let me show you what we've done so far. So, so far over here, this is like a bunch of stuff that I'm either going to give away or sell because it just needs to get out of here. And then we've collected like a bunch of trash. My mom actually just took the garbage out now. But yeah, and then my mom's taking this shoe rack home because like I said, I have the shoe cabinet now. And we're just trying to get everything together. Like, I've kind of... This closet in here is just, like, fully empty. Actually, I have, like, two things in here that I'm going to wear. But for now, it's empty. Um, I'm just getting rid of a bunch of stuff. These drawers are fully organized now. This drawer actually connects with this piece, the top, and um, the legs over there. So that's my vanity. So I have to put it together. I just have no idea where I'm going to put it. And then in my office, I also found a bunch of crap that I bought for no reason. Like, I got these, like, pans. Look, $21.99. Like, I'm, I never use them. And, like, these mugs. I have so many mugs, y'all. That is the next... Look at this freaking thing. is in the kitchen. This over here is the next task I need to conquer. I need to get rid of so many cups. Look. Like, my Starbucks cups are not too bad. Like, I have a few, quite a few of them, but not too many. But the mug situation, I have so many mugs. So, y'all, I'm going to be selling all these because I just cannot. I just cannot. It's just too much. Like, I do not need all this. It honestly just stresses me out. So, some of the stuff that I'm getting rid of, I mean, they're going to sell online. Like, the shoes, the bags, the clothes. I'm going to sell on my curtsy. So, I'll have that link down below if you guys want to check that out. Just, like random stuff I'm selling and then the rest of this stuff will probably do like a yard sale on one of these weekends to get rid of this stuff because I don't know where the hell that where it's gonna go yeah probably just keep cleaning vacuuming decluttering stuff like I said I need to go through all that stuff in the kitchen and figure out what I do and don't want to keep um and then we're gonna head out to lunch because I am starving like I literally ate those Cheetos in the car and like that's it my mom ate the popcorn we didn't eat any real food today so we gotta get some real food and I really want some pasta so yeah, let's get back to work. It's like, I don't want to get rid of my mugs, but there's so many. There's too many. Let's be honest, there's way too many mugs. But I like them all. Wrap them up. Bog in there? Yeah. 
Now we're going into Wegmans to get some snacks. Let me, let me find a good one. Girl, you better get a little one. Oh, yeah, sorry. This one looks good. Hold on. No, this one looks good. This is like the best one. No. Another thing you need to try is the Wegmans lemonade. The best, literally the best one. So as you guys saw, we went to Wegmans, got a few snacks to have. Um, I said earlier in the vlog that we weren't staying overnight, but we ended up just deciding to stay overnight because it's already 7.30 and once it gets dark, it is not safe to drive home from here because it is the roads are just, it's not safe. So we decided to just stay overnight. We actually booked a hotel down in Vestal. So we're going to Target right now to get a few things for the apartment. We're going to finish as much as we can tonight. Hopefully like everything that we that's really important that we need to fix and like clean up and stuff. So yeah, I'll keep y'all updated on the progress that we make tonight. Hopefully it won't take us too long. But I definitely just want to get my vanity area set up and move the clothing racks into that new closet space that I'm making, kind of setting up. And I want to try to get the shoe cabinet put together, but I don't know how complex it is. You know how Ikea furniture be, so we'll see. But those are like the few things that I really want to get done. Everything that needed to be like decluttered is pretty much out. Like we put all the stuff that um, we're going to do like a yard sale and I have some stuff I need to sell online. So we pretty much have all that stuff packed up in the car. Um, but there's not much really that I need to declutter. So it's just, you know, organizing and getting things set up the way I want it. So. Hopefully it won't take us too long and then we can just go to the hotel and relax for the rest of the night. But for now, we're going to Target. Probably, yeah. Yeah, this Target always has like a nice section of like yeah. apartment stuff. Look, look how much nicer this Target is. It's, I don't understand. Oh, you said the rug has to be like 5 by 6 right? I mean, that's what we're looking for but if you find a five by seven you would just have to move your the white what shelf up yeah 170 dollars yeah, for that ugly ass rug That's no ma'am So we only ended up getting a few things from Target. We need to go to Home Goods as well to look for some stuff. But first we checked into the hotel before it got too late. So that once we're done with the apartment, we can come right back. So let's do a quick little hotel room tour. All right, so when you first walk in, you know, typical hotel door, as you know, there's a nice body mirror right here, which is good, even though we're only here for the night, but I still like a nice mirror in the hotel room. And then to the left of the door is this really nice bathroom. This is a Hilton hotel, which, you know, it was last minute. So we weren't being too picky, but I definitely was staying at no day at Motel 6. We wasn't doing that. So, you know, nice little bathroom, nice big mirror, towels and everything. I love the counter space because I always usually bring so many products, but 
Today I have like none of my products that I use. And then just a nice little walk-in shower, whatever. And then this very tiny closet, which is interesting, but you know, I already expected that because I've been to this hotel before. So it's literally just like that freaking bar and a few hangers, but that's okay. And then a little mini fridge, no microwave, which makes no sense. How are you gonna have a fridge with no microwave? But anyways, and then there's two queen beds, which is perfect. Not that I didn't want to share a bed with my mom, but <laughs> no, it's just better to have two beds. I don't want to share a bed with you. No, no, it's not just like, oh my goodness. If we stayed at the apartment, we would have to share a bed anyways. Exactly. Without Chuck there to bite our toes. Listen, don't talk about my son, okay? But yeah, two beds, lots of outlets, very nice TV, and your name is on the TV. I didn't even. Yeah. There's probably Netflix. I hope there's like wow, something good. I like that. That's weird. Nice TV. I'm surprised they have all this. We just booked the thing. Um, the desk. And then bam, that's really it. And then out here is literally the parking lot. I should, well, I'm not going to open the curtain. But you can see this is the curtain. It's actually really nice. And then outside is the parking lot because we're literally on the first floor. Which is so weird to me. Like I've never been on the first floor in a hotel. So it's like, it's very strange. But it's just for the night, you know. It's gonna be nice, relaxing. We're gonna get done what we need to get done. Come back, sleep, and it's gonna be nice. Nice AC, look, the AC just turned on. It's gonna be nice and cool in here, oh my goodness. Oh, I should bring a blanket from the apartment. I have blankets. Yes. Perfect. Can we bring two? Yeah, and I might, yeah, yeah, we'll bring the blankets. Cause I don't like, I don't like sleeping under the hotel stuff. Well, I don't know. I think that new vlog, I'm about to watch that. Who? Peyton? Oh, I think I watched all of them. I'm, I'm not caught up yet. Um. So yeah, we're gonna head to Home Goods before they close in an hour, get what we need to get, and try to just finish everything before it gets too late. So we about to head back to the apartment. I know we're gonna head to Home Goods, then back to the apartment and get back to work. Like they added so much. Look at this freaking Home Goods. I like. I thought that. it was a ring light, but it's just a lamp. That's really cool. Oh my god, we're getting so distracted. Oh my we God, will, look at all this stuff clearance section. <laughs> oh no, ma'am. No, no, no. We no, gotta we check the go. clearance. We gotta check oh, the clearance. No. I see God. a trash can. That's what I need. God. I need a garbage. Look at all these lamps. You oh my God. Are those laundry baskets? Probably not. What about this? That's too big. Mom, I can get this for you. If you don't get out of here, that dumbass. Don't wobble. <laughs> You know when they talk about the landlord special in the apartment? <laughs> oh my god. This apartment really? this is, is the landlord special. This is like, the ultimate landlord special? <laughs> no, no, no. Look, this is the inside. You want to do the other way. Like, it's much better than it was, but it's still shit. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, girl. Sorry. <laughs> I, can't, I can't even cook it up. <laughs> <laughs> no, this is really ghetto. Get me out of here. Look at that. I know, baby. Don't look at it. Don't look at this it. This is the last of us. <laughs> what is that? Just don't look at it. It just covered up. What's his name? Where's Joel? He need to come get these for Get these, get these damn. Oh my this god. This fun guy. I'm gonna turn into a damn clicker living in here. I'm not <laughs> even kidding. Why are you... Look! <laughs> Alright, what are we doing? Oh, I wasn't gonna go through. I thought we wanted a seamless look. Oh. <laughs> you know, I'm tired. I don't know what I'm doing. I mean, it's, it's a seamless look. Who gives a fuck? <laughs> <laughs> like, we doing some nice DIY. Give me a seamless look, cover that mold up. Yeah. All right, so we made it back to the hotel. Thank God, I am just exhausted. Like y'all, I'm so ready to go to sleep. Not even go to sleep, I just need to lay down. I'm gonna take a shower and get comfy. But let's do a little random haul stuff that I bought because I was unprepared and didn't bring anything. So first we have these wonderful toothbrushes from Target. These are the best toothbrushes. They're only 99 cents for two, They're perfect. Um, then we have this Crest Pro Health toothpaste because why not? 
Um, and I have a face wash, like I had extra face wash at my apartment, but apparently I didn't keep any extra skincare there. So I just got this little Neutrogena moisturizer. I didn't even grab sunscreen because y'all, tomorrow we're going to get up, do what we got to do at the apartment and go straight home. And then I'll do what I need to do at home with my skincare. But I just needed like a moisturizer and face wash. That's like the, you know, the staples. That's the essentials. Um, next was something I didn't really need, but it was just something I found at Home Goods. I got these, um, slip scrunchies. Let me open up the plastic. Oh my god, these are so freaking cute. I'm so glad I found these. They had so much nice stuff in Home Goods, y'all. I was shocked. Um, so yeah, slip is like my favorite brand to get the pillowcases, the scrunchies from. So I was so happy when I found these because these are super cute. I'm like literally obsessed with their um, bigger scrunchies. I don't really like the small ones. Like I have two of them. Like I use them sometimes, but I prefer the bigger ones because you know, it's just, you know, easier on curly hair. But the fact that they're silk as well, it just like, it's so much better for when I put my hair up and stuff. So I'm glad I found these. Another thing I didn't bring was undies. So y'all, I had to get some underwear from Walmart. I'm wearing these to bed and I'm throwing these ones on tomorrow. So bam, cause yeah, I, I needed some clean underwear. Cause apparently I didn't leave any, the only extra clothes I left at my apartment were pajamas. So yeah, I will catch up with y'all in the morning. Shocked. all right y'all quick update before we end this vlog so we left the hotel we slept real good last night we had so much fun um we came back to the apartment did a few more things cleaned up so that you know when people come to show the house or whatever It'll be decent and I also fixed up some stuff and decluttered a lot of stuff in here so I'm happy about that um, still you know in the process of looking for other apartments and stuff now um, and the apartment above me is actually available so we're looking into that as well but we will see um, so let me just kind of show you guys a little bit of the progress as you can see the entire living room is now empty I still have well not empty but there's still a few things like we just got to get rid of this but it won't fit in the car right now but we're gonna come back anyways um, but the couch is still covered because I don't want nobody touching it um, the bed has like all the pillows and blankets and stuff but I have my clothes in here I need to put away I put my suitcases with my clothes in there this stuff is gonna be put in the storage area once whatever we had to put a damn sign up, y'all, because it's so, like, humid in here. It's ridiculous, so, you know. I just put a few things in here for now. We were able to get everything out of the kitchen, pretty much, that needed to go. But, yes, we are heading out now, finally. I'm ready to go home. I'm tired. It's hot as hell. And I'm just, I'm just ready to get up out of this apartment, y'all, like... I can't wait to just move into a nicer space, better space, and everything. Um, we'll see as time goes on, but I'll keep you guys updated on the whole apartment situation in um, vlogs after this. But I'll definitely keep you guys updated on the apartment situation as things, you know, continue. But I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys in the next video. Um.